Okay, welcome back to another episode of the Dakota Planet Student Spotlight. I believe this is episode 28. 28 or 29, yeah. Yeah, 28, I think, actually. Um, and your name is? Logan Archie. Okay, Logan. Uh, what grade are you in? I'm in 12th grade. How's, uh, how's senior year been? It's going pretty good. Uh, about to make sure I graduate. I have a little bit of trouble in uh, math and English. Yeah, same here. I felt that. I don't know. English is just so like hard. <laughs> Eng- English just does too much, honestly. I think English just be doing too much. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, math you can sort of get a handle on. English you, j- you gotta write essays and stuff. Math is easy. You literally just like look at like how problems are done, and then as long as you know like how to solve this problem, you're in. Exactly. Like, you know, like, don't don't like worry about how complex the lesson is. Just, just worry like, about remembering the formulas, and yeah, then you're golden. Make sure you know how to look at like every type of problem and know how to solve it. Other than that, you don't need to know anything. Like that's my general advice for math. It took me like two months to remember who my master's name is in that computer game. Yeah, but nobody, nobody ever remembers their manager's name, let's be honest. <laughs> that was just an example. That was just an I mean, example. I, I, mean, I remember I my last manager's, manager's name. Point technically too. So math is a little hard. It is definitely difficult, yeah. Yeah. But, uh, uh, what, uh, do you do any, like, extracurricular activities at school? Extracurricular activities. I'm not in any clubs or anything. Um, I drive my friend home from school with that counts. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. a good activity. That uh, is very good. school sometimes all right okay what's uh what's your favorite like subject that you have just your favorite class that you have right now probably woodshop woodshop uh, with, with i got mr c mr chad and pow that's my boy right there shout out to mr c um shoot yeah pretty fun. how's uh like what do y'all what do you do in that class so so we've just been building a table over this period time being in that class but we're d- we do like one part each day and some days we don't actually do any work on it we just do like that it was pretty fun it's pretty fun by the end of it we'll have a table that we build ourselves so okay so each person makes their own table. yeah i was about to ask that so like it's just you do one part a day or you're like are you allowed to do more so like some days they'll say okay we're coming in eat and we have to wait an extra five minutes for chip to, to get there and then they say okay they'll show us what to do they have an example and then we have to go get the supplies we have to figure out everything to do it and then we have to do it as much as we can and we have to clean up the whole shop so we just kind of get as much done as we can in each day that's most days so we just get more things done each day if we can but uh like uh, a couple days before break we just watch the movie Maybe at least we can. Sorry, I don't remember how we watched it. Oh no, the reason we the uh, vacuum was broken, so we couldn't collect up all the dust to clean up the shop. That's why uh, we had to watch a movie for the for the work. And, yeah. mm-hmm. Okay. Well, I <coughs> I know you didn't say you were. I know you said that you weren't in any clubs, but um, like if you were to ever join yeah. a club in the future, like what, Wh- what would what your would you what would be your preferred club or sport that you would like to join? I think there is. There, there might be. I'm, I know I mean, there's um there's like certain clubs where they uh they talk about like like just whatever the hard pressing topic is at the time like yeah, so yeah a lot of be, debate clubs. Well, I, somebody somebody in this class doesn't or is like a part of it. I think it's called JSA. I don't I don't know all the details. I could like let you know later, but yeah, I like to uh, debate, argue in this class. Someone said, <laughs> big arguer. <laughs> what uh? So what kind of stuff do you do outside of school in your free time? Um, I have a lot of fun. Uh, lots of fun. Uh, you know, hang out with friends. Uh, um, uh, long, I, enjoy long pauses. I enjoy long walks on the beach. Um, okay. I do different. I live my life here. I 
a day to day basis. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, so we're kind of reaching the end of the interview here. We're a little bit over the five minute mark. Um, I just like to wrap it up. We always ask this to people, like, what is um, what would be your message or just a piece of advice, something you learned over your time that you could give to anybody watching this, anybody in the school, just you know, a solid piece of advice you got. Be a good person. Be a good person. That's all I gotta say. Yeah, that really is the best be advice. A lot of people like it's hard for them to. To be like really like your moral compass should be what guides you almost like I'm not gonna like like me like personally like if, if I think that something's wrong I'm gonna voice that you know what I mean if you don't want to be uh, if you don't you know you might be better for your own way you just gonna let it happen you just gotta honestly live your life the way you want to live I'm your life break my stride, man. basically yeah. all right I like that that's a solid interview yeah all right thank you. It's nice to meet another Logan. Alright, have a good one now.